Why do we get smog alerts in the Montreal area in the winter time? In Quebec, especially in the winter, the biggest source of particulate matter is wood burning stoves, um, wood burning ovens, and fireplaces. The smoke that's released, it just it just kind of stays near the surface. And also, we tend to see an increase in the use of fireplaces and wood burning stoves when it is cold outside. Environment Canada says smog alerts are issued when there is poor air quality over a period of at least three hours. The weather conditions can make the situation worse. It usually happens when we're in a period of quiet, cold weather because that air just gets trapped right near the surface. So we don't have any winds that are going to flush it out. In Montreal, you could only use a wood or solid fuel burning appliance if it emits fewer than 2.5 grams of particles per hour. And you can't use them at all when a smog alert is in effect. Since the city put its rules into effect, it says there's been a big drop in the number of winter smog days. There were just two in 2018, compared to 27 in 2008. But one advocate we spoke to says people aren't respecting the rules. We have to go all the way. Uh, the, the stoves have to be uh, taken away. We have to ban uh, wood burning in cities, that's for sure. But we also have to reduce all the pollution coming from the transport the sector. At Beaver Lake, people say they've noticed the smog. It's unfortunate. Hopefully things can get better, but until we find new ways of, create new ways of energy, it'll, it'll keep showing up. I can be like worried for my health. How can Canada control all of this? It's a really, it's a question we need uh, to put on mind. Environment Canada says it's not clear whether these smog days will increase or decrease in the future, but it does say that the transition to electric vehicles and less wood burning could improve air quality.